Okay, now we reach into this menu, poly surface selection. Open it uh, when you hold the mouse over this icon. You can open the menu, click and drag here to open the uh, menu separate and I want to explain it. Here you can select all poly surfaces. In a previous lesson, I explained the difference between poly surface and the surfaces. Those are poly surface for us. We can select all of them. Here you can select open poly surfaces. As you can see, we have an open poly surface and it's in settings. Its properties say yes, this is open, this is closed surface, this is closed extrusion. Here you can uh, select closed poly surface. Those are closed poly surface. And uh, we have uh, something called lightweight extrusion. I will explain to you this uh, to extrusion and uh, these tools, but uh, I want to uh, give a brief explain about that. As you can see, the uh, lightweight extrusions are uh, extrusion object. This is extrusion. Select a curve, extrude it. As you can see, we have a curve on a straight line going up. Or it can turn. As you can see, if we change the straight line, a division, a subdivision will be appear here. And this is not uh, light wave extrusion anymore. If you select it, as you can see, other will be selected. Just so, we have to a straight, a simple line, a straight, and we have a one continuous surface. It is very a smaller object. Those are very a smaller object. As you can see, we have a division here. We have division here. We have division. They are, those are not lightweight, and they use less memory and they are faster to navigate. And the final output uh, size or value of your file will be very smaller. Those are called lightweight extrusion and you can select it. Uh, all of the, these objects, for example, cube, cylinder, um, piping, they are lightweight, lightweight extrusion. Select visible object. For example, going in this angle, as you can see, you can just uh, visible, um, for example, just visible those object here. If you select that and click and drag, as you can see, just a visible object we selected. All of the object back of those objects are not selected. If you select in a regular manner, regular way, click and drag, all of the object will be selected, as you can see. But if you want to select just visible, for example, I see that, you can see the click and drag. And you can select just that. So click that. As you can see here, uh, the software say you tell you to please drag a window to select object and then press enter. And it's automatically done. You need, don't need to press enter. This is select visible. It select only the visible object in a uh, direction of your camera. Okay, this is select poly surface and you can close it and it's always here.